Now to a developing story from Kellogg's World Headquarters in Battle Creek. A hazmat situation there sends nearly two dozen people to the hospital. Jermont Terry is following the latest developments from the newsroom tonight. Jermont, do we know what happened? Well, Kimberly, we've been monitoring the situation all day on ClickOnDetroit.com, but all signs right now point to this being the Freon leak causing this evacuation. Close to 1,000 employees work at the company headquarters now, but this hazmat situation was confined to just one tower. And while the leak happened this morning, this afternoon, we can tell you that this leak is contained. But the section where the, where the scare started has been closed all day. The Freon is believed to come from a refrigerant leak in the North Tower. Now that's where the majority of the evacuations happened today. If inhaled for long expo exposures, Freon can cause some breathing concerns. That's why those who complained the problems went directly to the hospital. We've transported uh, 18 people to Battle Creek here, uh, Battle Creek Bronson here in, in town, and then five to Oaklawn. Um, latest I got was they didn't think anything was real serious, but uh, again, we wanted to make sure we get them transported for uh, precautions. And again, no serious injuries reported. Still no word tonight when that North Tower will reopen. But you can imagine quite a scare this morning in Battle Creek. For now, reporting live in the newsroom, Jermont Terry, Local 4.